guys welcome back to another episode of going medieval so hopefully we can get this um particular building finished today there's not too much left to do outside of the marlins and some tile work i guess um looks like there's some blocks under the uh floors there that need to be finished but outside of that that whole room's pretty much ready and then I think what we'll start doing is we'll start working on that bridge here. Oh, right. Almost forgot. We needed to get um, that house built. So let's go ahead and tell them to not worry about that at the moment. And hopefully they can mine that out. And then we'll be able to squeeze in that house there hopefully i still need to measure the area i remember saying that last episode so we'll need about four blocks i think that's what i did over here right so one two three four and then five so we're looking at about I don't know, somewhere around here is where our wall will be. So we'll need enough room to um, at least a couple gap, like a couple block gap. But everything else on that other side will be able to go ahead and um, build the house in. So we should have enough room to build one, I think. Uh, the houses are only that big, so we should be able to squeeze one right in here if we get a little bit closer on that side, I think. That should be fine. Uh, might need to have the entrance over on this side, but it should fit. And we'll just wait for them to finish building that first, though. I don't know where our miners went. She was apparently doing some... Oh, mining over here. Yeesh. Yeah, we do need that mined out, though, so... It's not really something I can say not to do. So, uh, yeah. Uh, we still need to get sheep. A... How old is this one? This one's mature, so I'm a mature um, goat and sheep. We'll see if we can't send a caravan out right now. And hopefully we can get somebody out there.
Great, so they just about got everything mined out here, so that's perfect. Um, I've been just kind of uh, letting them do their thing for a little bit, and then I was hoping that they would get it done in the next, next couple days. They got most of the stuff built, so they'll be ready for building the house. I think they've been working on this at the moment, which is great. So we can finally plot out where we're going to build the house and stuff like that. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to try to align it with this house. Um, we'll probably leave one barrier behind, like one block, so they can get through. And we'll make sure this is all set up. And we'll go ahead and branch out like we did in the other buildings. And that should be the right size. All right. And we're going to need a window. Uh, we'll put the window over on this side and the door on the other side. Reason being, um, the path is closer over here. So they'll be able to get up to that really easily. So. And we'll change that, and then these ones need to be updated, whoop. Sometimes find the auto selection a nuisance, but on the other side, I really wish some things had it. Um, like, for example, it's good for selecting multiple settings and stuff like that, so if we wanted to change all these walls, we could do that for the style, but um, things like tree farms you can't actually set the settings though it would be really handy to especially if you wanted to um, allow them to sew or not sew because the way that the new shading me mechanics and everything works like the light levels and stuff um, you have to be really careful with where you plant things and stuff like that but it's like during winter and stuff you used to be able to have like one long line of trees now you kind of have to have it sp spaced out right so all these are individual things it would be nice to have it the options for all of these over on this side for um enabling and disabling them just a preference but <clears throat> it would be nice a uh, little feature to have uh maybe i'll suggest it for the developers and hopefully it will get um some likes. I usually, the, usually when I do actually um, suggest something, it gets quite a few likes, which is interesting. Okay, I'm going to bring that to right here, I think. Uh, we'll probably do a double path. So like that.
All right, so North just came back. Uh, we got a mature ma female uh, sheep and goat. So they just finished hauling them in here. Oh, I think one's still on the way. Uh, possibly, I don't know. Nope, oh, it's in here. They're all in there. We should probably make another couple barns for them as well. Uh, because the cows are pretty... I, I think there might be a cap on how much can actually be in a given area. So it might be good to have the goats and the sheep in their own little... Um, area so once we get across the bridge or we could even set up another thing like because there's stairs going down at the moment so we could always build across the way uh, the house is just about done so they'll be finishing that up in a couple couple days I guess maybe tomorrow uh, we have just like one two three four parts left for them to build and it should be finished uh, minus the banner that's not finished yet but that shouldn't take them too long to do and then we can start focusing on a couple extra barns we'll probably put them over over in this area I guess I want it close to the road but it'll take some measuring uh, let's see here Somewhere around here should be good. I'll try to design it the same way as um, these two barns. Well, maybe not that one. That one's pretty fancy, but uh, we might be able to get something going with uh, what we have here. So uh, we'll go ahead and branch it out like that. And I think I put a window right in the middle. So we'll try to follow the same blueprint as we got over there. And I'm not sure if that's what I did for this one. Sort of. These two are like that though. Okay, and then I went, it's like a five area wide one. So these trees will have to go. Guys, we got quite a bit of stuff done today. I got them to build a new barn. Well, 
a s additional barn. We'll need that for our goats and sheep to start with. And then we're going to eventually build a another barn, which will probably be next to that one, which will be for either goats or sheep uh, specifically. So there's going to be one for goats, one for sheep, and then so on. Um, they just have a little bit of the floor to finish and we have the interior to build, but uh, we got pretty much this part done. I just got them to put in the stairs not too long ago. They need to still build. Oh, no, 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 no. Didn't realize that was bricks. I don't want bricks. I'll have to fix that. <laughs> Now I'm starting to wonder if all these are bricks. This is a wooden beam. Okay, I'll have to uh, fix that quickly. But um, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.